It is a very brisk February afternoon, but it's Friday and the sun is shining and it's a perfect day for a great men's lacrosse action for you as the 15th ranked Boston University Terriers take on the Bryant University Bulldogs here from historic Nickerson Field on the west side of Boston. In his second season, who is an offensive minded coach, as that one is scored and Bryant is on the board. First goal from Jack Lonsinger, his fourth of the year. A couple of possessions as Jimmy Core weaves around, gives up the pass, good feed into the middle, and BU is on the board. It's Thomas Niedringhaus coming into the slot. Bryant successful for a third time from the faceoff X, and the spinning finish inside gives Bryant back the lead in short order. They have had the edge there in the first eight minutes. And it looks like both teams starting to settle in. Speaking of settling in, it's the same exact play that they've scored on now, not once, but twice. Not just in the Patriot League, he might be the best long pole in the nation. As that one slips through, BU on a tight angle could not keep it out. But BU needs a goal and needs it badly. And they get one. Whipped home on the sidearm. Gorgeous finish by Tommy Bork. Sometimes a little bit overshadowed by the potency of the offense, but the skip pass finds its way, and Kevin Groninger has his hattie. That pass found its target, and it's the second tight angle shot today that's gone home, and Jack Lonsinger joins the hat trick party. The pass to the left wing. Pass got through. It went through everyone and it left a wide open man, but very, very compact schedule. Two months, 14 games, and a goal for BU as that one sneaks inside that far post and just take more time off the clock. That's Tegan Alexander who took the ball all the way up. And it eventually finds its way to Mason Druin, and Druin makes it 11 4, trails by seven has the man advantage, pass gets to the short corner, and that is as critical, clinical an execution as you can as Brendan Kelly tucks it in right cage. And Bryant will see out these final few seconds, and that reaction from the bench says it all.